a breed read. When is a pitbull not a pitbull? That's the riddle being pondered in Cambridge after news that a highly publicized dog attack on a newspaper boy and his mother earlier this month may not have been what it seemed at all. Twelve-year-old was on his way on his, to his route when a dog identified as an Amstaff ran out of the front door and badly mauled him. Uh, Attorney General Michael Bryant immediately seized on the incident to drive home the need for an all-out ban on the breed in Ontario. But it now appears the dog, named Lyric, wasn't a pit bull, or an even an Amstaff at all. It's a mutt, confirms Bonnie Beacon of the Cambridge Humane Society. I suspect between three and five different crossbreeds of something. The animal was sold through a newspaper as an American Staffordshire, but it was never microchipped or tattooed. After the, after the attack, the Humane Society determined it was actually a mix of a Whippet, Great Dane, and even some Dalmatian. Breeder Tracy claims it's ample evidence of why Bryant's much-vaunted BSL doesn't have a dog's leg to stand on. It really upsets us when we find out that they say this is what this is, and it's not, and it doesn't look anything like our breed. There's always going to be another breed that bites. If you condemn the breeds and the purebred dogs, that doesn't save you from the crossbreds. Uh, Bryant's legislation calls out for all pit bulls in the province to be spayed or neutered and muzzled when they're in public. Owners will be able to keep their pets for the rest of their lives, but, will, but won't be able to get a new one. Lyric, the, the dog, is expected to be euthanized. Meanwhile, pit owners are letting the issue die, but they're planning rallies uh, to try to nip Bryant's bill in the bud.